Good morning everybody, so it's day three of us being in the house. Um, it's Sunday today and obviously we moved in on Friday. I didn't actually film anything yesterday because it was just another hectic day and I didn't really fancy picking up the camera. Um, but we pretty much got like some more boxes unpacked. Matt's got pretty much all of his clothes there now. Mine are all still at my mum's. Um, but yeah, I just woke up this morning. I've had a coffee and I've just trying to been like trying to tackle the second bedroom. Not that there's we can do much at the moment, but all of my clear boxes I've just put in like this cupboard um, over the stairs, and I'll probably put like some of these boxes in there as well. I um if this even focuses, I, this is like the laundry basket thing that I had from uni i do want to get like a white wicker one um eventually some bits on the floor still but most of it's in there um and then yeah what's through here the bathroom sort of a little bit more set up obviously we want to get some drawers or something in here we need to get like toilet roll holders etc and this is our crack in the window which they've got to replace I don't know how they missed that one, but yeah. Um, that's pretty much it. I think I put the hoover in the cupboard up here as well. I've hoovered like twice already. And this is all of the filth that's come up. So that needs emptying already. Matt, have I shown you all the filth that's come up at the hoover? Yeah. And then downstairs, the kitchen is sort of pretty much all unpacked really. Well. I lied, it's not, but it's, it's getting there and I need to sort the drawers out of where we want things as well. But this is what the kitchen's looking like at the moment. We've got all of these like cards and a bunch of flowers on the window there. These are, I think that's an empty box. The box behind is full of my Minnie Mouse mugs and then this is full of like little kitchen bits that I need to find a place for. Um, and these, I'm a bit annoyed because we bought like a um, a big saucepan set from Procook. I've never used them before but I heard like good reviews. But the stock pot and the shallow casserole dish, um, the like the actual saucepans bent out of shape. Which is a bit annoying. All of the other saucepans are fine. Um, but yeah, that's just a bit annoying. But this is our Joseph Joseph bin. Let me just show you this because I actually think this is amazing. So <laughs> this is like the normal waste. And then this is the food bin. And that's how filthy my floor was when I moved in. And then down here, you've got this drawer that comes out, which is just recycling. So I think that's pretty good, to be honest. And then we've got a little plant here, which we got from Chloe. Some candles, just our like little gifts from everyone. These are our utensils. And then, yeah, you've got like our kettle and toaster, another Lovely bunch of flowers from Matthew's mum. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. And then we've just got one lonely chair in here. But in the living room, this is basically all of our kitchen furniture in here. But we've got some more cards and two of our dining room chairs. The third one's over there. This is our kitchen sofa thing. And then we've literally just put the TV on... <laughs> my shelf and put it on the side so that used to be in my bedroom underneath my tv but obviously it's meant to be this way around so we've literally just laid it like that and put the tv on it's a little bit bending <laughs> um but it'll do for now until we decide what living room furniture we want and stuff so, so it's a lot later now as you can see i've actually done my makeup and got dressed um obviously this is our our bedroom we still need to bring in like my chest of drawers and stuff, but you saw that in the other room. And then maybe something here, I just don't know yet. But probably won't get that done till Tuesday, so. Um, so I've just tried to sort some things out. Um, I've done a little bit of washing up, although I wish I'd waited, because now I've unpacked some more boxes. I found some more stuff I need to wash up. But I've just put the dishwasher on. Um, I've been jamming out to Taylor Swift and some other bits like that. I've um, got out the little candle that Louis got us as a moving in present. 
And it's just this white company, um, Moroc Spa Candle, which is lovely. I just got that burning at the moment. Um, and then down here on the floor is what I'm trying to sort out. Um, so yeah, I've got some little like, oh, some little of these little lunch boxy tub things that can put like sauces or little things like that. Um, my Uncle Jamie bought me those or bought us those a long time ago as well as these little ones. He's got us quite a lot of like little bits that you wouldn't think of. Um, and stuff like that and like sandwich bag clips but yeah i found um my straws that jamie got us as well i need to put those in the wash and then um although this packet is missing a straw but that's because it's at home uh so is a straw cleaner anyway <laughs> That's back at home because um, I was using it when I was there. And then I found our Joseph Joseph chopping boards. Um, I love these because you can do all of your chopping and then rather than trying to like force everything into the pan, you just pick up the handle. I can't do it with my left hand, but you just pick it up and it sort of goes like this. Um, so everything can go into the pan. So this is really bad camera angles, but it will all slide into the pan like that rather than everything going everywhere. So love that. Well, you can see it on the picture here. And then I've also got a mini version of that. So I need to take the stickers off of those and they need to go in the wash. So this is like a little washing up pile I've got here before they go in the drawer. Um, and then, yeah, that's pretty much it. I've just got a few other bits. Like a duster and then these skewers need to go in the wash as well and then i've got some wooden utensils um a spoon and that they need to go in the wash um and then there's just like a, a mask in there and our, a plug socket i need to wash these pans up as well at some point um but that's pretty much it but um another little thing that jamie got us and that he's been or he does in his house is he has these little hooks that he hooks on his cupboard um, to like hang your keys on or tea towels. So I'm just going to try and attach that to um, the cupboard now. Just so I can hang um, a set of keys up on there. Like when I get in, that's where I can hang my keys. So I'm just going to hang them in this cupboard here. Up here, I think, somewhere. So let's try and see if I can work that out now. So... Oh, it's just that it's just in the cupboard with a boiler i'll just show you for example and just hang the little keys up there um oh and these are my keys i might do two hooks one for my keys and one for matthew's keys but we'll just hang them all on one hook for now maybe i will do two but yeah that's quite cool and then my auntie got me this so she's got a little cleaning or Mrs. Hinge kit, as she called it. It's got the Zoflora, um, fluffy duster, spray for the Zoflora. She's got these cool like um, bin things that you sprinkle in your bin to stop it from smelling. Um, obviously the pink stuff, which is what Mrs. Hinge swears by. Got a little um, foamy thing here. This to wash up with, which is probably gonna save my nails at the moment as I've just had them done. So I'll probably I'll get that out now, to be fair. Pop that in there. And then she also got this peg basket. These are um, the pegs that I got, um, which are just the minky pegs. But they come in a pack with blue and green pegs as well. I think there are four packets worth there. But what me and my mum done was she's got the green and blue pegs that come in the packet and I've kept the pink and purple ones because she is a nice mum and she lets me keep the girly colours but yeah hello everybody and welcome back um i haven't actually vlogged in like a couple of days but we've now got the blind man coming um no he's not blind <laughs> he's coming to measure up for blinds and our curtains and um yeah, oh, Matt's done it already. So we're just emptying our bin for the first time. Um, so you can see the little garage is open there. 
but we've also had a crow in our garden and I think he's injured. He's like poodle on the floor here. And he just keeps hopping around our garden. If I zoom in, you might be able to see him. Poor bird, but I don't really know what to do with him. We've just kind of left him for now. But we haven't got anything to feed him with or anything like that, have we? We don't really know what to do about the crow. He's just been hopping around the garden, hasn't he? Oh, you stood in this I haven't stood mess. in the bird plop. So yeah, we've just emptied our bin for the first time. Which was quite handy that these little bits come out as well, wasn't it? They're like wheels or something. The bottom is. That's very bad. Have you not used the bin? Huh? Have you not used the bin? What do you mean? Since we've been here. No. Well, not to empty it. Oh. It's the first time we have emptied it, isn't it? Um, we need to put some of the bags. bags back in. If you want to leave that one out, I might just spray that one down with some Dettol. If you want to get the Dettol, and just spray the food one. So it has this little like food waste bin, but where we live, you don't actually have a food bin, if that makes sense, that comes to be collected. So it's a bit of a pain, but um, yeah, just spray, spray in there. Um, and it did come with some Joseph Joseph bags however i think these are quite expensive so we probably won't be <laughs> repurchasing them hopefully from like the supermarket we can just find the little bags but um um what i wanted to use is um in my auntie's like hinge basket that she got for a moving in present she's given us this um bin fresh stuff um, and it keeps being fresh and clean for days. So shake regularly into your bin bags, into your bins and bin bags to eliminate bad smells and soak up excess liquid. Should we give this, this bad boy a go? Some bins. It's a bit lot, that's... Whoa. You're meant to put more in, I think. This is, this is for 10 piece. grand. So we finally got the bin bag on. <laughs> Do it properly. Yeah, there's a bird feed. <laughs> and then we also swapped our saucepan over because this got delivered from Pro Cook and the like the top, what's this called? The lid didn't fit on the the pan, so we went and they just exchanged it for us. And then we ended up buying like a colander, a potato peeler, and also a pizza cutter because we realised we didn't have one the other day. Um, so yeah, oh, and we bought a walk here, but yeah, we've just got two. Cool.